hydroelectric power station takes its water from a lake whose water level is at a height of 50 meter above the turbine assuming the overall efficiency is 40% calculate the mass of water which must flow through the turbine in each second to produce a power output of 1 megawatt take g value as 10 meter per second square for example a lake is there which is 50 meter above the level of a turbine and falls on the turbine okay so now the overall efficiency of system is given as 40 percent and power output is given as 1 megawatt power output 1 megawatt let's convert it into kilowatt so here it becomes sorry in watt SI unit this become 10 raised to power 6 watt now we have used the formula of efficiency as power output by power input here power output is 10 raised to power 6 power input we have to calculate and efficiency is given as 40 percent 40 percent means 0.4 so here power input after getting cross multiply we got 10 raised to power 6 divided by 0 0.4 and this become 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 watt but this is the power input which is given by the water we have to calculate the energy in order to calculate the mass so energy we have power into time power input we have calculated that is 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 watt into time they are talking about each second it means time is given as 1 second so here energy we got it as 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 joule now we have to calculate the mass so here energy we have already calculated as 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 joule and this energy is actually stored in the water in the form of potential energy so potential energy we have 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 joule now we have to calculate what we have to calculate mass we know that potential energy formula we have mgh potential energy is 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 mass value we have to calculate g value is 10 and h value is height 50 meter so mass here we have calculated as 2.5 into 10 raised to power 6 divided by 10 into 50. So here we got it as 25 by 10 into 10 into 50 and 10 raised to power 6 means 6 zeros. Okay. So now we have to just cancel it out. So here you got 5 into 1000 as mass is equals to 5000 kg it means that the water flows 5000 kg in one second they are actually uh, asking about the mass flow rate so mass we got it as 5000 kg when for each second clear